Good morning. Good morning. Hello, hello. How are you? Good morning. Morning, Exa, Elena, Sinia. Good morning. How are you? How was the weekend? Was it good? Yes, good. Yes, good. Hey, did you so, did you do something special? No. Just stay home. Yes, stay in my house, and I have to give the dog to other people. <gasps> hey, no! You gave away your your dog. Yes, because wow, excellent. you were so happy with Loki. Yes, but when I let alone, uh, she start to cry and howl. And howl. How? How? Mm -hmm. so, exactly. uh, oh. it's, it it <laughs> could oh very desperate with. Mm -hmm. uh, well, oh, with I'm sorry. Or, uh, before die for the surprise yes uh, maybe depression <laughs> i don't yeah, know if, if the animals can have depression i don't know but have another dog. oh my god mm -hmm. oh i'm sorry how do you feel uh i feel sad because i don't have company but i'm very happy because it is better right yeah, yes. Mm -hmm. I am sorry. I'm gonna get uh, Ili is gonna give you a cat. <laughs> Ili no, has cats. I, I <laughs> you don't like, like cats. Oh, okay. Um, you like you have cats, right, Ili? I remember. Yes. I uh -huh. How many you have? Only one or two? One. one ah, two, only one. Two dogs. Ah, and two dogs. Okay. Do they get along? The dogs and the cat. Do they get along? Uh, yes. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, so it was a, a myth that cats and dogs are always fighting. <laughs> okay, that's no. nice. <laughs> it depends. Yeah, depends the, 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 the breed, maybe, la raza, the breed, maybe the, depends on the breed of the dog and, and how well the dog is trained. I understand that, okay. Nice guys. I'm sorry then Nexa for the loss of your 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 dog. Okay. But anyways, maybe you can get another one, a little one, right? A uh, no, uh, my girlfriend have two dogs. So uh, So uh, the solution is to have your girlfriend with you. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're going to start to get the uh, one dog uh, mm -hmm. all weekend. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. To get the uh, used to, para que se costumbre. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. To get used to. Okay. Nice, nice solution. Very nice. Well, welcome for the rest of the guys that are uh, joining the class. Gabi, okay, Araceli, Dalila, okay. How was the weekend? Was the weekend good? Relaxing? Stressing? Tiring? <laughs> good. Good. Ay, Araceli, good. Did you eat pupusas? No. <laughs> Yes. Yeah, okay, good. Well, no, yeah, I understand. <laughs> oh, ayote pupu, delicious, huh? Eh? Ayote pupusas. One of my favorite eh, pupusas. Y la otra es de uh, cochinito, le llaman, but it's not pork, no pork, no no meat, it's, it's a plant. I don't yes, know. Uh -huh. It's cochinito. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cochinito, I like that. Uh -huh. With tomato, onions, okay. <laughs> that's that's nice. Oh, Araceli, very nice. Well, my friends, this is a well. The, the the we continue right with the. This is for you. Remember, as I said before, this is for you Wednesday. Okay, Wednesday in the in the week. Okay, um, last week we were we were doing the exercises for section number two. Okay, talking about. Uh, you remember, uh, Gabby, you remember the topic from last week? Thursday and Friday, do you remember the topics that we studied? Hello, Gabby, are you there? Elena, do you remember? Yes, yes. Ah, Gavita is there. Hello, Gavita. Uh, mm -hmm. Imperative 
and infinitive. Aha, uh -huh. gerunds, gerunds. gerunds and infinitives to give suggestions, okay? And we were doing some exercises uh, related to, you know, giving suggestions for uh, different, different contexts, right? Make sure to, don't forget to, try not to, okay? Those were the, the phrases that we were practicing. Then the other session was uh, related to infinitives and gerunds to describe the purpose of an object, okay? For example, we, we did some examples like the drying, uh, for example, the hair dryer is used for drying the hair or is used to dry the hair, okay? So that was um, section number two about guys, okay? The section number three, because we're gonna jump up the section number three, remember that for this week, you have to finish section two, section three, and the midterm, okay? Hay un examen de medio curso, the midterm. So you have to finish the midterm for uh, this week, okay? So we are going to start, okay, with this one and they are festivities, okay? Festivals, okay, celebrations, etc. okay? And this is, uh, okay, uh, based on the topic that we are going to study with section number three, okay? Uh, what are we gonna learn today? Well, today we're gonna learn to describe, okay, to describe festivities, okay, or celebrations using a, the word when, okay, when. I'm gonna go over the explanation, okay? So, uh, what's your favorite festivity or, or, or celebration, okay? Uh, let me ask Araceli. Araceli, what's your favorite celebration of the year? A celebration that you consider is like, wow, you feel very happy when, when you celebrate this. What is your favorite, Araceli? Mm, I think it's uh, December 41. Ah, 40 or 30. Oh, 30, 30. Oh, okay, okay, Araceli, <laughs> very good. So it's New Year, diga, New Year's. New Year's. New Year's Eve. Uh -huh. Very good. New Year's. Ah, okay, very nice. No Christmas. The New Year. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay, very good. What about for Sophie? Hello, Sophie. Good morning. Good morning. Hello. Oh, hello. And what's your favorite celebration, Sophie, of the year? Maybe Christmas. Christmas, okay, yeah, yeah. very good. Okay, Itzel, what about you? What's your favorite celebration? My favorite celebration is Christmas. It's Christmas too? Okay, yes. good, very nice. It's. I think it's for the, I don't know, the, 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 the feeling, right? The environment, I don't know. Ili, do you have a different one or is the same, Christmas or New Year? I don't have a, a preferred day. Ah, oh, a favorite day. A favorite day, uh -huh. but I like uh, a vacation on vacation on a Semana Santa. Holy Week. <laughs> Ah, okay, okay. So you enjoy more Holy Week, the complete week. <laughs> okay, yes. okay, very good, very good. Well, today, guys, I'm going to present different festivals, okay, or celebrations, just for you to know a little bit about them, okay? I know you already know, but, you know, there are some words, important words that we can practice today, right? I'm going to ask uh, Carlita Beatriz. Good morning, Carlita Beatriz. Morning, teacher. Morning. How was the weekend? Good. Um, good. Good. Okay. From good. one to ten, <laughs> what's your score? From um, one to ten, maybe eight. Mm, okay. Was it good? It's was good. It good? Nice. <laughs> Very nice. My friend, can you please go over the reading? Okay. Uh, New Year's Day. Mm -hmm. uh, January first. It is a federal holiday. 
people generally have New Year's parties and social uh, gatherings. Uh -huh. Gatherings, that's okay. Gatherings. Many people may come home very late from the previous days, New Year's. Uh, if parties mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, during the day, families and friends usually have a large fest to celebrate bringing uh, in the the new year. The new year. Very, very, very good. If you talk about El Salvador, where I can say here, family, most of the families, not all the families, most of the families play la bala and sing and, and dance. Okay. They eat the 12 grapes. Uh, another, another, another one that we have, do you remember for new year? Eat a, a grapes. Well, the 12 grapes, I suppose. Uh -huh. They are. I don't know, teacher. Quemar pólvora. Ah, they, they burst. Repeat. Some burst fireworks. Burst fireworks. Okay, very good. That's it. So uh -huh. this is common in, in El Salvador and in other Central American countries. I, I know. Okay. Here we have one. Gatherings. Look, gatherings. This is meetings okay when people get together okay gatherings gatherings meetings social meetings okay this is new year very good itzel hello good morning good morning teacher can you please read valentine's day yes the most romantic <laughs> okay valentine's day february 14. Mm -hmm. Celebrate uh, in memory of St. Valentine. This holiday is highly uh, commercially commercialized, commercialized, um, lover express their feeling by exchanging gifts, flowers, and greeting cards. In principle, a Valentine can be for anyone you care about, not just a lover or boyfriend. In practice, though, thro uh, though, though. it is limited to lover and spouses. Uh -huh. Spouses. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Very good. Very good. So the second one, Valentine's Day, right? Supposedly this is only for, well, this is, it has to do with friends. Okay. And very good friends or relatives you care about. But uh, in practice, it says this is like, normally we have, you know, people limit this just to lovers and spouses, right? And the spouses here is could be girls or boys, right? That's it. So this is highly commercialized. And then people say, no, come on, Valentine's Day is not just for, it's not just for this day, it's every day. Well, it's difficult to celebrate it every day, man. <laughs> okay, because there are ups and downs, you know, everything is not just like oh, love and love. Okay, but this is specific. February 14th. Okay, Sinia, do you celebrate Valentine's Day? Yes. Yes, ah, okay. Do you remember the last gift you gave your husband or your best friend? So I don't know. You remember? I celebrated my boyfriend. Ah. with my husband. Ah, vaya que lo grabado. That's good. That's good. Okay. Do you remember what, the present you gave? What did you give? Candies or or a shirt or flowers? Flowers? Yes. To him? To him? No. He to you? Uh, yes. <laughs> no, you to him. What did you give? Uh, I prepared the dinner. Ah, okay. You prepared dinner. Very good. Ah, okay. With a candle. Ah, okay. <laughs> Romantic. Con crema lo hubiera puesto. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, great. Very good. Next, okay. This is other celebration. Okay. This is the Good Friday. Okay. Good Friday. That's it. Uh, Dalila, can we please um, read this? 
Good Friday. Uh -huh. Good Friday. This is, this is in Holy Week, okay? Remember, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, the, the Holy Week has five days in a week that we say, oh, we have a week off on Holy Week. Uh, but the Good Friday is specifically for for the, uh, the, the in, in religion, right? To celebrate this in El Salvador, oof, Catholic people celebrate it very very well. Okay, so go over, please. Uh, this reading, Dalila. Good Friday. Good, good Friday. Observe the Friday before Easter. All way falls on Friday. It commemorate mm -hmm. the, the crucifixion and death of Jesus. Jesus. Uh -huh. Jesus. Okay, very good. The crucifixion and death of Jesus. Okay, yes. this is the Good Friday. This is other celebration. Uh, what other, Gabi, what other activities people do in the Good Friday in El Salvador? In Francisco, give me another one, please. According to what you know, according to what you have observed, okay? What do people do in the Good Friday in El Salvador? In, in Semana Santa? Yes, in, in, in Holy ah, Week, okay. Uh -huh. in, okay, but, okay. but specifically in the Good Friday. Okay, it's mm. commemorate uh, the crucifixion of Jesus and make uh, alfombras. Ah, mm. in, they make carpets. And celebrate... they carpets. Ah, okay, carpet and celebrate um, a service in the church. Okay, so, very good. Uh, so uh, the, the principal objective is uh, remember about the death of Jesus in the cross. Okay, very good. Okay, thank you very much. Uh -huh. Other, other uh, activity that people do in the Good Friday is to make carpets on the street, right? Okay, very good. Give me another one, Gabby. Other one that you remember? How do you say Via Crucis? The Via Crucis. <laughs> That's okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, 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 oh. Mm -hmm. I don't know how or to part, say Santo eh, de, de, Because de, in the, the night on Friday, mm -hmm. eh, they have a, a, a Santo Entierro. The Holy, the Holy the, uh, Friday. Uh, Ajá, and the, and, the, and the Good Friday at night, but only uh -huh. for men, right, Gabby? No. No, and... Uh, for everybody. Thurs no, for everybody. Thursday is the, the, the procesión del silencio. Ah, okay. I, I suppose it's the silence parade. I don't know, something. Let me know. Procession. They call it silence. Yes, it's true. I agree with you. Let me let me check the other ones. Uh, this is only for men, right, Gabby? Yes. And Friday is for everybody. Uh huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. true. Another one that I have observed uh, is that people um in the Good Friday, they don't listen to music. They don't uh, scream. Eat meat. They don't eat meat. Thank you. Uh huh. Okay. Those are other activities that people do. Okay, in the Good Friday. Well, it's based depending on the kind of religion you have, but the most common is a, a for 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 okay the the Catholic okay and the Christian in the in the other way. Uh, well, there are a lot of people that don't do this okay, like like carpets or whatever, but uh, it's more than commemoration, right? Okay, what happened that day? Good, very good. Let's go over the other one. Ah, oh, this is coming, right? Halloween, okay. Karen, good morning. Can you please read Halloween? Karen, Karen, are you there? Hi, Karen. Karen, what are you doing? <laughs> wait, wait. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay, <laughs> Okay, okay, Karen. October, October 13, uh -huh. 30, 30, 31, 30, 31. 31st. Ah, yes, 31st. Mm -hmm. It's it's not a holiday, but rather than a festival. Festival. After uh -huh. it gets dark, children walk through neighborhoods asking for candy 
children are often dressed in scary costumes, such as with witch mm -hmm. or ghost or costumes like fairies, cartoons, mm -hmm. <laughs> characters, or whatever that place crazy. Yes. Uh -huh. Craze. Craze. Is. Oh, okay, very good. That's it. Very good. La última locura, dice. <laughs> the latest craze. Okay. Is. Okay, very good. Halloween. Franklin, do you celebrate Halloween? Franklin de Jesus. Do you do you celebrate Halloween, Franklin? Is it a is it a festival that we celebrate in El Salvador? What do you think? Do you celebrate it, eh, Veronica? Let me see who has a problem. Ah, Franklin has problems in the audio. Okay, well, but Franklin is telling me via chat that he doesn't celebrate it. Okay, and and you, Vero, do you celebrate it? Elena, do you celebrate Halloween with your children? Exa, do you celebrate Halloween? No, I don't celebrate, but celebrate. some play celebrate with dance or a party. <laughs> yes, it's true. Some restaurants celebrate it, right? Uh -huh. And people go disguised yes. in different crazy stuff. Uh -huh. Okay. Here in the place where I, I live, it, it, it's going to be a celebration and they are sending invitations. And, and if you walk around the neighborhood, a lot of houses are, you know, decorated with uh, skeletons, uh, with the ghost or any other kind of uh, decoration for this. My daughter told me yesterday, mommy, we need to sell a, we need to decorate our house. And I said, no, I couldn't say no because I don't like that celebration. I said, no, I don't have money. <laughs> I need to work to buy the, all the decoration, okay? But it is, when I was a child, I celebrated this, guys, believe me. I dressed up like, I don't know, like a ghost or monster. And my brothers, my cousins and I walked door by door, knocking on the door, receiving candies, okay? And obviously the, the neighbors knew that it was ah, the little, little ladies. <laughs> so they gave us vaquita candies. You remember in the past, right? So that was Halloween, okay? The other celebration that we have here. Obviously this is like a representation, right? In the United States, okay, is celebrated, okay? To the maximum, that's it. And the last one that we have here is Christmas, okay? Ili, can you please go over this? Christmas. Remember, Christmas is not December 24th, it's 25th, okay? This is the real day, okay? Evie. Okay, Christmas, December 25th. It is a federal holiday. Christmas celebrates the birth of Jesus Christ. Christ. As the, Christ, as the majority of the U.S. population is Christian. This is the biggest festival of the year. Many people purchase an evergreen tree and decorate it with lights, ornaments, and tinsel. Many houses are decorated with Christmas lights, and you may see animal models like reindeers, it up, and front yards. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. Reindeers, you know, the reindeers are the animals, okay, with the, the horns there. Okay, very good. Uh, do you, do you, do you decorate your house, guys? Do you decorate your houses on Christmas? No? Carlita, Joanna, do you, do you decorate your house with a Christmas tree and... No? Good morning. Morning. Yes, I decorate the, for the light. Ah, oh, okay. With the light. Inside the house or outside? And inside and out. Oh, that's cool. Nice. Yes. Very good. Okay. So you, you celebrated and decorated. Okay, good. Good. And the, in the Christmas tree? No. Uh, somebody uh, the years. Mm -hmm. No, not only all the years. One year 
Yes, one year. Oh, no. really? So what about this year? It's not, or it's for the next one? I think that, yes, because the last year, mm -hmm. I um, put the tree. Ah, okay, 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 okay. You didn't, you didn't uh, put the tree there. Okay, good, <laughs> nice. And, and, and what about you, Vero? Are you going to decorate your house? Are you decorating your house this year? Well, today we have a we have a, 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 a different year, right? I don't know what is it gonna be like. Okay, Berito, are you going to decorate your house, Berito? Vero one, Vero two, Vero three. Well, it's not there. Well, my friends, we're gonna go over this, okay? This is so easy, guys. This is so easy. It's more like the name, okay? But don't be scared of the name, okay? This is the relative process of time. This today's class and tomorrow's class and the rest, we're going to talk about this topic, okay? Today, I'm going to introduce when, okay, when, this is the word that we are going to use for this. It says something like this, okay, Exa, can you please read this? Relative clauses. Relative clauses of time refer to a time, date or moment, previously mentioned. Mm -hmm. Relative clauses of time are usually introduced by the verb to be. Okay, very good. This is something that you have to remember, okay? You have to use the verb to be. Don't, don't forget the verb to be. Am, is, are. Okay? Next. Okay, this is the structure. What is the structure? Okay, what is the structure that we're going to use? Uh, let, me, let me ask here, okay, uh, Sophie, can you read the structure in color uh, red? Yes, date plus verb plus relative clause of time. Okay, very good. Look, date is the name of the celebration, okay, the name of the festivity or the date, October, November, etc. After that, my friends, you have to use the verb to be, okay, mostly is is. Okay, for example, here I say November 2nd is, eh, is, and after the verb to be, as Sophie said, you have to use the relative clause of time. And what is the relative clause of time? Well, when you start using when, okay? So I have some examples here, okay? Francisco, can you please read the examples? Read the number one, Francisco. Okay, Christmas. Christmas is, okay, Christmas is when people celebrate the birth of Jesus Christ and uh, okay. uh, give, give gifts to their loved, loved ones. The loved ones, very good. What is the date, Francisco, in the sentence? Christmas. Christmas. What is the verb to be? Uh, yes. is when okay. people celebrate the birth of Jesus. Oh no, only the verb to be, the verb to be. Ah, okay, is. Is, very is. good. Yes. And the relative clause, guys, is when. Here is when you have to use when. So, teacher, but okay. the relative clause of time, only the relative word is when. But then, guys, everything you mention about the celebration is called the relative clause of time. So you use this already. I know that when you want to describe something, okay, eh, you use relative clauses of time, right? So you use when, and then, guys, you start describing the date, okay? That's it. I'm so sorry for Christmas because I just forgot the letter T, okay? But you put it there in your examples. Next one, okay, uh, Francisco, read the second one. Summer. Okay, okay, summer Summer is the time when people go to the beach and get tanned. Tanned, uh-huh, tanned. That's, tanned. That's okay. it, this is like bronceado, right? Okay, summer. Teacher, but summer is not a celebration. Well, no, guys, it's not necessary to mention a celebration, but you can use any other, uh, you know, day that you want to refer. Verb to be is, okay, is 
Aquí yo le puse, is the time, ok, porque el, el verano es, la, es el tiempo en donde, ¿eh? ok, when, and when you say, when people go to the beach and get down, this is the relative clause of time, ok. We're going to have other examples, ok, eh, but you're going to help me. Algo que toda la gente se queja, Mondays. Ok, Mondays. Ese sería mi date. ¿Qué va después de Mondays? Is, is the day. Yeah, but this is plural. Ah, ok. It's mm -hmm. day. Are. 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 Very are. good. So, Mondays are... Day. Days. Mm -hmm. The days we can say, right? Uh, son los días de... Uh -huh. Are the days... Now, relative clause. You start describing the Mondays. Boring. Okay. When? When? Uh huh. Uh, when all people no desire work. <laughs> when all when people work, feel tired. <laughs> feel tired. <laughs> feel tired. Okay, very good. So you are describing the date. You are describing the date. Mondays. Okay, that's it. like. I know, teacher, Mondays are the days when oh, people feel tired and boring. Ah, okay. Well, this is the description. Using relative clauses of time. Okay. Another one. I have another one for you. Okay. Um, payday. <laughs> payday. Uh -huh. So, can you describe this special day, please? Is when is the best day. <laughs> payday is, uh, is the best day of your life. Uh, no, no, no. Supposedly it's your marriage. <laughs> is it is the day when is uh -huh, is the day uh -huh, when, when all people receive all people uh -huh, receive uh, the salary, I don't salary, know, salary, uh -huh. salary. Okay. Uh -huh. very good, very good, oh. very good. Teacher, I have other description about the payday. Well, other people say payday is the day when I don't have money because I have to pay all the, the bills. <laughs> well, it depends, guys, when. When you use when in the description, it's optional. It has it, it has to do with, it, with your opinions, with your backgrounds, etc. Okay. For me, for example, a payday is the day when I have to uh, when I have to uh, spend all my money because I have to pay many, 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 many bills. Okay. Ah, okay, teacher. Other people say payday is the is the day when I feel very happy. Well, good. That's it. So it depends. Another example. Okay, I'm telling you this because it is not just for celebrations. Remember, I told you celebration festivities, but it's not focused only on that. Okay. Uh, another one. I I have another one. Okay. Uh, June 17th, for example. June 17th, uh-huh. What do you know about this day? Is it Father's Day? Uh-huh. Okay. Is it the day when, when is, is it the day when when celebrate? Uh-huh. Is the day when when celebrate? Okay, you have to use a subject when um, okay. people. When people uh -huh. when people, people celebrate. Celebrate, uh huh. The Father's Day. Uh huh. Father's Day. Very good. Okay, that's it. Okay. Maybe for for Brenda is June seventeenth. Teacher is the day when I when I uh, give a present to my father. Okay. Other people, he uh, said, well, June 17th is the day when I go to the cemetery and put flowers on my father's grave. Ah, okay. Well, you know, the description is depends on your uh, background, I said, depends on your experience, 
or religion or uh, customs, etc. Okay, so this is what we are going to practice right now. I'm going to give you some of them and I want you to uh, start practicing here. Vamos. Take a picture for this, please. Number one. What is the number one, uh, Brendita? What is the number one? Read. Halloween. Halloween, number two. Halloween. Day of death. Day of death. death. Uh -huh. Number three. Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day. Number four. October 1st. October 1st. And number five. Mother's Day. Mother's Day. Okay, take a picture of the or copy the celebration, please. Okay, I'm going to give you, okay, in this case, I'm going to give you 15 minutes to give me a little example of the, the definition of that celebration. Remember, use the structure, date, verb B, and the relative clause with when. Okay, accept the invitation, guys, and let's start practicing right now with your partners. Llegando. No te creo, no sabía. Sí. ¿Y a dónde están llegando? En el 15 estamos llegando. Mm. <laughs> I am listening. <laughs> I'm sorry to be yeah. <laughs> Okay, let's do the number one. Yeah. What is the number one? Eh, ahorita. I am check ah. uh, Halloween. Ah, Halloween. Uh -huh. Halloween are the days when all people uh, celebrated with the candies. Ah, okay, with candies. Very good. Um, okay. Please check uh, Joa, uh, the, 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 the verb to be. It says Halloween is, is ah, on yes, plural, Sunday. is are. Okay, that's it. Okay, okay. Yes, go over, okay. please. Hello, hello. Uh, you're alone. Oh my God. And Franklin, where is Franklin? Supposedly Franklin is with you. Okay, I'm going to send you to another group. Okay? Okay. Okay, okay don't worry. Be happy. Let me check here. You want to go to this room. Okay, accept the invitation. Okay, can I, hello, good morning, girl. Morning, teacher. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, refresh your, your, your memory with the uh, structure. Ponga la estructura arriba y yo se la doy y luego, okay. Date, Halloween is when people. Uh, date is, are, the verb be, plus when, and the relative clause. Aha, uh -huh, that's it. Okay, vamos a ver si está así. Halloween is, ajá, uh -huh, ok. Póngale ahí algo después de is, is, Halloween is the celebration, Halloween is the day, Halloween is the festivity, etc. Uh -huh. The celebration, ajá. Uh -huh. Ok. Of the... Ok, si ya le pone eso de witches, de la celebración de las brujas y todo, ya le quita la estructura de lo que estamos viendo. Solo quédese ahí. Halloween is the celebration when, y después de when le puede poner todo lo que quiera, de witches and the candies and everything. Uh -huh. Ok, remember the verbs are in present, ok? The verbs are in present. 
Halloween is a celebration when people, uh huh. Now you continue. People, when people and child, no. And children, and children. And children go out and ask for candies. Okay. Uh -huh. That is when people visit when the people their dead, como muertos que es como visitan a sus muertos. Dead, dead. The cemetery. Uh -huh. Wow, the cemetery. Uh -huh. Sí, porque panteón no existe. <laughs> And remembering. Sería, the day of the dead is when the people visit the cemetery and remember, remember y recuerdan a sus, a sus remember familiares. Remember their relatives. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Permítame, recuerdan a sus Their relatives. Sí, es remembering their relatives. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. When you, you want to say there, eh, Francisco, you can say this and Look. remember. T-shirt, it is you? Yes, it's me. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm reading in, in my computer. Uh, no. Okay, look at this. Look at the screen. Remember their dead relatives. Ah, okay. Got it. Uh, like, recuerdan sus parientes muertos, right? They're, mm -hmm. they're, uh, okay, thank mm -hmm. you. Okay. Remember their dead relatives. Okay, thank okay, you. Okay, continue. Thank. Uh, number three is uh, Valentine's Day, no? Mm -hmm. Okay, yes. Valentine's Day. And, and remember. And remember. Mm -hmm. Remember. Uh, your, your family. Oh, no, sus seres queridos. Eso. The second one, uh, hello girls. Hello, Good hello. Morning. I'm Good gonna morning. check the number one. You say Halloween is the day when people disguise and give, give. Give. Ah, no, give. es que nosotros decíamos regalar. Sí, regalar, ajá, uh -huh. give, dar. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. Big candies, uh -huh. okay, to children, porque los candies se les dan a los niños, right? Uh -huh. <clears throat> candies to children. To children. Uh huh. Exactly. Okay. Check candies, please. The the the, the spelling of candies. Uh, why? I... Ah, candies. Ah, candies. Exactly. Mm -hmm. The day of the dead is the day when people visit visit the what? Visit the family. Visit the grandma. Daddy. No. The... Cementerio. Ah, the cemetery. Visit, uh, visit the cemetery. Uh -huh. Mami. Uh. Mm -hmm. And remember. Remember una M. Remember. Mm -hmm. Una M. Remember. Remember. Um, what do they remember? The relatives, right? Sus seres queridos fallecidos. Ajá, sus the seres dead, queridos, algo así. The dead relatives. The dead relatives. Dead, D-E-A-D, dead, dead. Delete death, ajá. This is muerte. Ah, ok. Quiero que pongan muerto. Dead, y with D, ajá. Dead, Ahí, dead. Yeah. Ah, ok. Ajá. Uh -huh. Relative. The dead relative. Excellent, ajá. Así. Dead relative. 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 <laughs> no problems with it. <laughs> don't worry, that happens to me. I don't know. I don't know. Se llama. ¿Cómo se llama eso que ponemos las letras antes de otro? Dyslex. No. Sí, yeah, we have. A <laughs> okay, the number three is a Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day. Ah, oh, Valentine's Day is the day when I cry a lot. <laughs> Uh -huh, Valentine's Day, uh -huh. is, is the, the day uh -huh. when people commerce mm -hmm. that day. Uh -huh, Intercambia, people... regalos. Uh -huh. Exchange. Uh -huh. 
es el verbo que estaba allá. Exchange. Exchange. Uh -huh. Ajá, exchange. Exchange. Exchange is, a, exchange is what we did. You remember last year we did this with a um, secret friend? Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh, I gave mm -hmm. you one and you give me one. This is exchange, okay? Or, Gabby, what do you have for lunch? Ah, teacher, chicken. And you, I have a spaghetti. Do you want some spaghetti? Yes, and give me some chicken. Okay, let's exchange food, right? Okay, so this is exchange. So Valentine's Day is the day when people exchange what? Gift. Gifts. Uh -huh. Okay, very good. Continue, please. If, like a uh, secret, how is secret? Secret friend. Mm -hmm. Secret friend. Uh -huh. Oh, friends, right? Secret friend is what we usually do at work or something, but uh -huh. if something comes to your heart, is for your loved ones, right? It includes, remember, it is not just for boyfriends and girlfriends or something, okay? It is for, for best friends, good friends, or people you really care about, okay? Okay. That's it. No, 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 no. no. I'm meeting with the clients, I... No, no, no. Ah, sí, sí, va a batir, pero de verdad no tenía que dormir. En inglés, Karen, en inglés, come on. <laughs> yes, sorry. <laughs> that I, I was worried, have... I was worried, la batida, de preocupada. I was yeah. worried. <laughs> Last Friday, I, I couldn't uh, take the class because yes, I got to sleep uh, too early <laughs> because at uh, two. Uh, Two and a half a.m. I, am, I no got to sleep, way. and that for that you I were working or you were in class. a party? No, no, working because I. <laughs> the next day we have a a, re, a presentation with the most important client. Oh my god! And I I have to finish the presentation. Uh huh. And oh my god! I spend more more time with this. Oh, I'm but so I'm sorry. Here, then I, I'm here this day. Excellent, very good. So Karen, wow, get up very early in the class. morning. Yes. And how was the presentation? Was it good? Was good. Mm -hmm. Yes. Nice. I, I, I feel so happy with the results. Excellent. And the client the most understand the point. Excellent, very good. Excellent, nice, good. Okay, congratulations. Well, when, when the result is good, right, no matter, right, what do you have to do? But yes. it's great, okay? Good, very, very nice. Okay, let me check. Let me check. <laughs> I have here Halloween. Oh, you have two, two, two Halloween right, definitions. <laughs> Halloween is a day when people wear uh, some costumes. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, with F S, please, Exa. Okay. Okay. Costumes. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. Let me check. Okay. The other one. Read it, please. Uh, let's see, Karen. <laughs> Halloween is the day when some girls wear like a bitch. <laughs> it's true. I know. I, I, I wrote okay. these sentences. <laughs> well, to be honest, most of them, they like to wear like, uh -huh, it's true. I don't know why, for example, if, 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 if I were to a party, I would disguise like, I don't know, like a panda bear maybe. <laughs> <laughs> or something like, but some other girls do it like uh yeah they, they do it like yeah. more 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 sexual stuff uh -huh. yes <laughs> it's like a bitch <laughs> day of the death is the day when some people go to cemeteries and put flowers on tombs uh-huh very good tombs with the s tombs. Yes. Valentine's Day is the day when some people give a present to a special person. Okay, very good. A present could be flowers, chocolate, whatever you want. Valentine's yes. Day is the day when some men declare, okay, oh, his love and spend all his money. <laughs> yes. okay. Declare in this case is um, propose, Ponga, propose. Ah, propose. Okay. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Pro, pro, pro. Pro, uh -huh. pro, proposed, pro. uh -huh. in, in present, in present. Ah, okay. Proposed, okay, his love to a woman, Ponga, to a woman and spend all his money. 
And some years after, they are hating the woman. Uh -huh. October 1st is the day when people can drink alcoholic drinks, okay, with no limit, <laughs> okay? Yes. Mother's Day is the day when people can celebrate to their mothers, okay, with S, okay, a, with a special dinner and gifts and other things. Okay, great, very, very, very good, excellent, okay, excellent. Okay, very, very, very good. So you are ready, right? To give the answers. Excellent, very good, very good. Finish. Yes, teacher. In English, in English, where do you live? Sorry, <laughs> teacher. Okay, ready, my friends? Yes? Yes. Okay, very good. Now we're going to check it together, right? Very okay. good. Okay. So sorry, uh, Brendita has problems in her internet, okay? So I was sending a message to her, okay? Uh, well, we're gonna check, okay? Uh, we're gonna check, uh, what do you have the number one? Uh, I will ask for, for Carlita Joana, okay? Carlita, can you please give me the, the definition that you have? Uh, Halloween is the day when all people celebrate with candy. Okay, very good, excellent, okay? Uh, Francisco, Halloween? Uh, okay, uh, Halloween is the day when people go out, treat or treat. Okay, very good, excellent. Okay, uh, Gabby, Halloween. Halloween. Uh, Halloween is the day when people disguise mm -hmm. and give candies to children. Okay, very good, excellent. Okay, Araceli, the last one, Halloween. Uh, is the say the ah. Halloween is, is the say with uh, or similar similar to to, 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 to Gabi. Okay, okay, yes, you were working together. Okay, I'm so sorry. So, uh, Areli, Araceli, sorry, go over the second one, please. Halloween. Okay, very good. The second one. What is the second one? Do you remember um, the no. day? Celi, I share the the sentence with you in the chat. Ah, okay. Uh, the day of the death. day of death. The day of death. Aha, uh -huh. that's it. That's the second one. I can read. Okay. Uh -huh. okay. Uh huh. Yes. Sophie, please. Okay, Sophie, I, go over it. Mm -hmm. I don't see the day of death is the celebration when people go to the cemetery and remember the their dead family or friends. Ah, okay, very, very good. Okay, nice, excellent description. Ili, the day of the dead. Day of death is the day when people visit the cemetery and their dead relatives. Okay, great, very good. Okay, Exa, the day of the dead. Day of death is the day when some people go to cemetery and put flowers on thumbs. On thumbs, okay, great, very good, nice. You see date, where to be, and the relative close of time, great. Number three, what's the number three, Franklin? Number three, Valentine's Day. And then we go with Sinia, okay? Hello, Franklin. Okay, Sinia, please read your sentence, okay, with a Valentine's Day. Yes, for a Franklin, he has problems with the computer in the in the audio. I'm sorry, Franklin. Okay, Sinia. Mm -hmm. Okay, the Valentine's Day is the day when our people celebrate in people the love. Ah, okay. Oh, it's so romantic. Okay, very good. Juan <laughs> Carlos, <laughs> what about you, Juan Carlos? Valentine's Day, what's your description? Hello, Valentine's Day is when people 
give gift to friends or couples. Ah, okay. Kiss. Gift. Ah, give that. Ah. And, and kiss and kiss. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good. Kiss and candles and more. <laughs> okay, very good. Dalila, what about the number three? Okay, no, number four, Dalila. Hey, October first. October first is the month when people celebrate birthday. Ah, the birthday. Very good. Is that your favorite celebration, Dalila? No. No, no. <laughs> I celebrate every day with it. <laughs> okay, Dalila. Thank you very much. Very good. Elena, well, Elena, no, Elena was with you. Uh, somebody else, Carla Aguilar. Uh huh. What do you have in October 1st? Um, October 1st um, is the celebration when people go to drink beers, okay, eat mm -hmm. and listen to music. To music, okay, very good. That's it. Well, I don't know if we have the celebration in El Salvador, in some restaurants, I think. Some restaurants, okay. Mother's Day, okay. Mother's Day is for Elena. Can you please read and Elena your description? Hi, Elena. Elena one. Elena two. Elena three. No, Elena. Okay. Well, hey, Gabby, read. Mother's okay. Day, Gabby. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Mother's Day is the day when people celebrate all mothers. Ah, okay, very good. Okay, all mothers, no matter where they are, okay, but people celebrate it. Very good. Next, the other, other, other um, a description, Karen. It, um... Mother's Day, Karen. Bye, bye. bye. Um... Mother's Day is the day when people can celebrate to their mother mother with a special dinner and give okay. and gifts and other other things. And other things. Very good. With a special dinner, special lunches, right? Or give different presents. Excellent. Okay. Very, very, very good. This is okay, what I call the relative close of time, guys. Okay. When you use the they, you use the verb to be. ¿Cuál es el verbo to be? Am, um, is, are. And then you use when. Después de when, por favor, siempre pónganmele un sujeto también. No me le vayan a poner un ejemplo. Mother's Day is the day when, when give presents. Ahora, yo, porque when give, ¿quién da? No se sabe, un animal. Mm. Who? Okay, when people, when a person, when my father, when me, when my, when I, when my sister, etc. So you need a subject there. Tomorrow we're going to practice, we're going to go over some other exercises to reinforce, okay, the topic that we have practiced today. My friends, ready with your attendance, okay? Yesenia Yvette Abarca Vasquez <clears throat> is absent. Okay, uh, Carla Beatriz Aguilar. Present. Very good. Uh, Veronica Beatriz Celso. Okay, absent. Oh, Osmani Etzaú de León. Present. Very good. Bania Itzel Deras de Cañas. Okay, eh, ella tuvo problemas con el Inter, se disparó un, un transformador, ok. Blanca Estela Marroquín es en Seguro Social right now. Franklin de Jesús Martínez is there, ok, present, very good, Franklin, in chat, very nice. Carla Joana Martínez. Present. Giovanni Alberto Orantes, absent, ok. Gabriela Beatriz Reyes. Present. Dalila Estela Silva. Laila. Dalila, hello. Dalila Estela, Estela Silva Moran. Well, is there, but is, she's not saying up. Uh, present, okay, but she's there. Maria Raceli Gonzalez Flores. Present. Cindy Elizabeth Mejia. Hello, Cindy. 
Sí, Nina. Hello. Okay, present. Sofía Guadalupe Hernández. Present. Eh, Juan Carlos Molina. Present. Claudia Eliana Casun. Present. Cla eh, Brenda Lucía Rosales. Present, teacher. Present, okay. Very good. Eh, let's continue. Eh, let me see. Herbert Iván Martínez is absent. Okay. Eh, Karen Lizeth Reyes. Present. Carmen Elena Cornejo. Present. Present, Elenita. And Francisco Isaac Cabrera. Present too. Okay, very, very, very good. Okay, guys, we can finish, okay, with the video conference for today, just to refresh your memory. Hoy comenzamos section number three. Quiere decir que desde ya comience con section number three. Para el jueves tiene que estar hecho section one, section two, section three, okay? Y vamos a llegar hasta el examen de medio curso, que sería el midterm, okay? That's it. This is for Thursday, así que háganlo cada día, vaya haciendo un poquitito para que no sienta que al final se le acumula todo, okay? Como les dije la vez pasada, ahora estamos en un programa diferente y ahora la plataforma es aquello a lo que le tiene que dar énfasis, ¿ok? Eh, no vaya a permitir que le estén llamando que por uno, por dos, que no hayan terminado la plataforma, el curso no avanza, ¿ok? Así que por favor, ayudémonos todos para no estropear el trabajo de los que muchos quieren tener o hacer, ¿ok? Thank you guys for joining my class. See you Thanks, tomorrow. Teacher. Have a beautiful Bye. morning. Have a beautiful morning, ¿ok? That's you it. Bye-bye. Thank, Thank you. Bye-bye.